welcome back to my channel, Lindsay Tries It, where I, Lindsay, have set out on this adventure this year to push myself out of my comfort zone and try new things. Over the past little while, I've noticed I haven't really been moving my body around much. So I decided I need to get more active, I need to get out there, I need to get my body moving, and hopefully it will help with things like sleep or self-confidence. But before I could work out, of course, I had to find an excuse to slow down the process and I had to buy some workout clothes because I want to look good when I am running on that treadmill. I will never run on the treadmill. I'm a walker. But anyway, Pennington's had a 50% off uh, active wear sale last weekend so I couldn't help myself and I went and picked up a couple pieces. Also, thank you to the person who said athleisure is a type of fashion. Um, you are a genius and a godsend, so thank you. So I'm gonna talk about the product a little bit here and then I will show a clip of what it looks like actually on the body. So let's begin. I've never really liked working out in shorts and I don't know if it's because sometimes they ride up, it just gets uncomfortable, so I definitely prefer like a pair of pants or a pair of leggings or capris or something. So I got these here. They're navy blue, but the part that I love is they have a little fun detail inside. Whoa. I don't wanna just be working out, I wanna look put together. So um, these are really cute. They are a capri length, but I really like that, that had a little something different. That's sort of, I would say that's kind of my style or things that I like are classic, traditional, but then there's just a little bit something different. If it's like a different neckline or a color or just like a small detail, such as this, that really stands out to me and I would I would say that's kind of my preferred style. I don't know what that is or what you consider that. And always, 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 I hear so many YouTubers talk about it, but it's true. Wait until there's like a sale or a special or a coupon to buy any of this stuff because more than likely you purchase it and then next week it goes on sale. And like this is 50% off, half off. That's a huge sale. So only shop when it's sale time. Um, it's a, that's a lesson I'm having to learn too. It always happens, I go into the store, I see something I like, I'm like, I need it now. Purchase it at full price and then usually like the next two or three days I go online and I see there's a huge sale on. Yes, you can return it and all that stuff, but after a while it just seems like more of a hassle. So wait for those coupons, wait for those sales. I got a couple pairs of bottoms because again, 50% off, why not? And these are the seven, eight leggings, slim leg. I don't really know what that means. I love the color of these. It's a really nice gray and black. And again, I like that the idea says it's slim leg, um, so it's not too baggy, but I wonder what seven eight means. Is that what the seven eight's referring to? Like, instead of like a three quarter, it's a seven eight? I don't know, fractions has never been my thing. I'm already out of breath from all the dead saying. Oh, and I forgot to mention, these are all in Canadian prices, but if you shopped during the 50% off, like a lot of these leggings um, came out to be just about 20 bucks. So they're regularly about 40 bucks, which I think is a little expensive. But if you save and get a coupon or like a special deal, it comes out to be pretty affordable. So the next thing I got, guess what? It's pants. And I just wanna put it out there. I am joking, by the way. For me, going to the gym is not like trying to look the best, but it's definitely something that I wanna feel comfortable in to make me wanna go more or to make me uh, be excited to go or not as nervous to go. So I definitely wanted to get something that I feel confident in. So as I'm joking about looking good, I really just wanna feel good at least when I'm there. So these are another pair of the seven, eight leggings. So they're a little bit longer again. Just a pair of black leggings, but what I loved was, wait for it, a little cutout design. So you can see there, just a little pop right there, a little pop right there. It'll show up better when I try them on. But again, something very classic, a black legging with something a little bit different. Cutouts, totally my style. So I love that. It also just like adds a little something to the outfit. So if you are gonna wear these um, out and about, which I will. So I got these tops, I got two, but just in different colors. The first one here, is in black you can take a look there it has a stripe pattern i really like their workout tops i find the material is very nice the length is really nice i'm about six feet so 
Having a nice long top is also very comfortable for me. So when you're working out, uh, because I'm still not super confident in my body, if you're like working out and your shirt rides up, it's no big deal because it's still covering. Whereas maybe some other traditional tops sometimes get a little too short for me and it shows a little much or I just become uncomfortable. And the next one, I really like this coloring. I think better than the black and white, but the black and white is pretty classic. This is the same shirt, just in a blue pattern. And again, it has the same seaming and stitching to sort of give it that, I guess it's more of like an hourglass figure. I am a true rectangle, by the way. I'm just as broad as I am uh, long, and I'm okay with that. I forgot to mention before, the sleeves on these tops are perfect because they got a little room. So when the biceps are growing, they got space to fill out. At some point, you just have to embrace radical acceptance. And these things aren't gonna change overnight. If you wanna change them, that's fine. If you don't wanna change them, you also don't need to. The last one, it's it was part of their active line. So I kind of think it would be really good for uh, winter or even the fall. Um, even if you're just like doing some walking outside or if you go to, I don't know, like a yoga class and it's cold out, you can just pop this on over top. It is made of the Thermolite. I've never heard of this before. So it's made by Thermolite, lightweight warmth. Their technology delivers lightweight warmth for your active lifestyle. So it just provides a little bit of heat. It'd probably be good to, um, you know, once the weather, starts to get a little bit colder if you enjoy doing stuff outside or skating or anything like that this might be a good layer to put on I love it it's a beautiful color you might be able to see or I hope you can see some of the pattern it has a very slight pattern just the um, stitching is just going in some different directions which I really like and again they're angled in and towards so it seems like it'd be something I will hopefully enjoy and also, I know a lot of bigger people are always afraid to wear horizontal stripes, and I just figure, like, who... For me, it seems silly that only certain body types can wear certain things, and I, I get that things probably look a little more flattering on other people, but if you want to wear friggin' stripes, wear friggin' stripes. No big deal. The last thing I got was a little bit dressier, a little bit fancier. Uh, my sister is getting married at the end of the month, and we're having a bachelorette party for her, so I kind of thought this would be a good top for that. It's very simple. It is just a black top, but what I love again is that little difference. It has a cold shoulder with a bit of a ruffle detail there actually. I've never seen anything with the ruffles and it also looks like quite an open sleeve. So it should be really hopefully flattering and comfortable. And I was thinking probably like a pair of jeans or a pair of leggings and some jewelry to kind of spice it up a little bit, but I think this would be perfect for an event like that. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. This is something obviously very new to me is doing a try on haul and showing everyone and recording it here. It's something that I personally really like to watch on YouTube so I can sort of get to see what's popular, these, you know, what's out in the stores right now, how it's fitting, is it running a little small, is it running a little big? And that way it kind of just gives you a little bit more information before you go out and shop. I'm excited to get my body moving more and I know it's getting a little bit cooler out there but fall is my favorite month and I actually prefer to be outside and exercising in this type of weather when it's a little bit cooler and you can wear pants or leggings and a sweatshirt or a coat. So I'm really looking forward to it and I'm sure Moose will also be very excited that we are out and moving a little bit more. If you liked any of the things that you saw today in the video, I will put the links down below and that way you can go check it out for yourself. The 50% off is not on anymore, but like I said, keep an eye. You can sign up for the emails with Pennington's and they'll send you like advanced, uh, advanced warning. Adv grab your money. I'll give you some uh, advanced notice that if something's coming up on the weekend and that way you can kind of get ready or plan to make a shopping trip there if you want. So as always, I hope you stay tuned to see what I get up to next time. I better do some like practice just to make sure it fits. Shot. Oh, good. Dancing with a drink. Yeah, this could be okay. These might get in the way. Jamming.